When you look back on your life, you should be proud of all of it. I'm just getting started. Somebody said, Chris, when are you going to slow down? Never. Hey guys, today I want to talk about one more financial concept. And that concept is a very simple one. We'll call it sleep on it. The sleep on it concept can save you a lot of money over time because what happens with a lot of people is they make spontaneous purchases. And spontaneous purchases are one of the worst places that uh, some people trip up financially. They'll see something that they want and they, they just can't hold themselves back. They, they start making decisions emotionally, which by the way, most of our decisions are emotional. We just justify them later with logic. But one of the best ways to prevent wasting money that way is to sleep on it. What I mean by that is if you see that car or that Suburban or, or that boat or what, it doesn't even have to be anything big like that. Just something that feels like a spontaneous buy. You've got to stop the spontaneous purchases and make sure everything makes logical sense within your budget and within your financial plan. One of the best ways to know uh, to prevent mistakes in this area is to just sleep on it. Wait 24 hours. And if it's such a great deal that it'll be gone in 24 hours and you just missed out on it, well then too bad. Most people are not broke because they let the good deals go by. Most people are broke because they jumped at too many things thinking they were great deals or they just had to have them in the moment or they didn't have the discipline to hold themselves back and just sleep on it, make sure they really wanted it and that it truly fit in their budget before buying it. And so here's my advice for today. Sleep on it. Talk to you guys at the next installment.